Hey everybody, we're continuing on with our commercial project in Rivet. And in this exercise, we want to create a power circuit. Now, we want to zoom into this mechanical room here. Uh, and I laid out all of my receptacles from the previous exercise. They want to wish y'all was time with that. I did discover these, they do these free are good for the floor. You can just use any floor. That's what I did. So now what we're going to look at here is how do you create a power circuit. So it's pretty simple. So I've got these laid out. So a uh, couple of things you need to, we want to review from the last exercise. We went to this panel and in its properties, we want to see that we named it, we're going to call them panel one. And uh, we're going to need 42, yep, we got 42 poles already. Right. Okay, so now we're all set to go. So basically, uh, the first thing you want to do, you, you would select the one of these receptacles, it doesn't matter. You'll select this guy here, and then you'll hit this power button here. You select it, and then there you see our panel, and we have a breaker. And then you want to go and you want to select edit circuit button here. So you select edit circuit and then you're actually adding on. So I'm going to add this one, this one, this one, this one. And then it's going to, it's going to panel A. So I'm going to say finish panel one rather. Okay, so there's one of our circuits. Now, if I go back here and have a look at, let me go on here in systems. Okay, now let me select this guy. Okay. So we're looking good there. So basically, I'm going to take you, uh, let's go and do maybe this room here. Same deal. Just go. Uh, we go to power, and then we go on to panel one again, there, and then we're gonna uh, edit the circuit. So we're gonna go with this one from, we'll take this one, this one, this one. And I normally like to stay with one room, and I'm gonna go finish. Okay, there's another circuit. So now, let's go look at our panel here. And then here, uh, we want to go look at this the panel schedules. So let's have a look at our uh, default template here, just for a minute. And as you can see, there's one circuit that we created. Okay, now, uh, wow, look at that. So we're going to go back here now, back to our plan view. And then I want to show you how, to, how, to, how to this circuit really works. So I'm going to go say, uh, select this one here. And then I'm going to right click here. I'm sorry, I'm going to tab this guy. And there's my circuit. And there's the home run. So and you can select arc wire here or camphor. I'm going to go at arc wire, that's pretty much the standard. And then finish. So there's one circuit. So let's do this one here now. Let's go, we, got, we made this one, so let's tab it. And there's our home run going back to our panel. And then we'll just say, inside here, go tab it again. Right click. And we'll say arc wire. So straightforward, pretty simple. Uh, I'm, I'm going to go here now. Let's do another room. Let's do a couple more rooms just for repetition. Uh, we'll go again. We'll go with our uh, select this DFCI, which is on the wall. And then we want to hit power again. And then we want to uh, edit the circuit. So we want to add more things here. So let's go add uh, this one. I think they want to include these, all of these over here. I mean, it depends on the load. Let's go finish that. We got another circuit here. 
Let's tab it. And I'm going to do our wire again. And that's finished. So you get the idea. We've done this before. So basically, we want to do our power. Um, this is this this is just home runs for circuits uh, for the power receptors. Then we have to do the same thing in the lighting and everything. So uh, we select this panel here and see what's going on with our panel. Okay, sorry. Okay, systems. Okay, so I'm going to do a few more of these. It's pretty straightforward and simple. You just grab one of these guys, and then you go power. And then, you know, you select your panel. And you got breaker here. And then you go, okay, what's going on here? Stuck. Okay. You can add to it. Let's say, let's go uh, edit circuit. And I'm going to finish it. And now these, let's see tab. So when I edit this circuit, I want to add to it. So I just go edit, and then I'll pick up these. And I'll finish it. Let's go look at our panel. Finish that. And then we got another circuit, I'll just tab it. And then we'll go arc wire again. And there's our home run. It's going all the way back to our panel. So basically this is it guys. This is very simple and straightforward. I might just push it into the electrical and lighting because we want to finish this thing up because this term is over. And next session we're gonna have more exciting things to do because you guys complain about easy stuff so we went and did this which is nice but the next project pro project is gonna be a good one so here I'm gonna go again uh, select this guy power and then there's my panel and everything here so I'm gonna go and I'm gonna just pick this And this, and that one, I think. And then I'm going to upload. I'm going to tab these guys so I get them. I'm going to get them out. So once you connect your circuit, uh oh, let's see, I didn't. Okay, I didn't do that one. So basically, I want to go here again. I want to go to this device. And then you can modify it. So when you see this, this means it's already in a, in a circuit. So like here, there's five there. So here, here. Okay, now I'm going to edit these guys. So here, I'm going to go here, there. Okay, that was already selected. Maybe I want to undo that one if I can. And I want to finish it. And then I want to do my. Okay, see, now I might want to edit this one because I didn't pick these up, or maybe it won't let me. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to finish that one with our wire. Okay, now. Um, Again, we'll just do this whole one, and then I'll do the second floor. Then we'll come back. So this one again is power. Um, we got our panel selected right here. We want to edit the circuit. That one. Okay, we're not. We don't need that one. It's already in the circuit. So we want to go with here, 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 and let's finish it. Okay, and then again, simply, let's go here and tab it. Okay, so we got a little problem here. I don't have a circuit. I didn't connect them, so I'm going to select. So I can do with this one. Again, so we need to create these out here. Because you select the power one, it's already 
gone, so it means you want to edit it. So I want to go edit this, and I'll just say add. We got the panel already there, so let's go. Oh, we did it. Okay, gotcha. How about that. There it is. Arc wire, and there's another circuit. So that's basically how you do a power circuit layout. Pretty simple, straightforward. Uh, then you've got your panel schedules here. Um, so what we just did, um, system. Okay, now let's go back. Let me just select one of these. Let's select this panel here now. And then what I want to do, I want to go here, let's see. Okay, here under the modify, under the modify equipment tab, we've got certain other settings here. So um, edit panel schedule here. And so if we look here, there's our panel schedule that we created. And there are receptacles. And now, I might want to do a panel with room names on here, which is also good. Uh, this is just a default one. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to just uh, drop this guy out of here. And next, we're going to look at our cancel that. Uh, we're going to look at our lighting now. So lighting is pretty straightforward as well. Uh, we got our light fixture drawn set up, so uh, basically, I'm going to leave it there, and thank you for watching, and we're going to come back, and I want you guys to do the first level circuit to create, to create your panels, and then we're going to go on the line. So, hey guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Please subscribe. It helps me make videos like this every day. Thanks again, and everybody be safe. Bye.